Hey guys, it's Jordan. Welcome to the Retro Toy Review. Today we are checking out Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Pizza Tossin, and we got Michelangelo this week. This is the 2022 re-release of the 92 uh, expansion line where they shot pizzas. And as you can see, it's got some pretty wacky 90s style super huge veiny muscles the crazy bulging eyes it's pretty stylized and it should be a cool toy so without further ado let's get it open okay guys welcome back it's jordan and like i said we are back this week for another retro toy review and this week we are looking at teenage mutant ninja turtles pizza toss and michelangelo this is from the 2002 re-release from playmates uh, this is from the 92 expansion line. Uh, they've been doing these annual re-releases um, recently for a bunch of them uh, from the 90s line uh, while the new Turtles movie and stuff is out. There's a big resurgence, which is excellent if you're a Turtles fan like me because then these are becoming back into availability without costing you an arm and a leg. This guy right here you can get for under 30 bucks without doing any resellers, which is pretty cool. And let's get them open. So the pizza toss in line, there's only three figures. And there's Michelangelo, Leonardo, and Raphael. And you'd say, well, hey, what about Donatello. I don't know what about Donatello. Donatello got shortchanged on this one. So if you were ever doubting which turtles sell the most or sell the least or the most popular, I think Donatello is unfortunately going to be in the bottom. Okay, and we'll get the mini pizzas out here. Okay, off to the recycling with this. Guys, make sure you recycle and cut up all your bits and pieces from your toys. Help the animals out. All right, and so this came with nunchucks, but the nunchucks are a little adapter that goes on to the bottom of the pizza shooter. I'm gonna try to get it on this side first. These are pretty tight. Here we go. We got one. And then there, that one went on a little easier now. There. And we got two. So that goes on the bottom like that. Then this is your cheese grating gun. You can see it's got a block of cheese going in there. You got the gun handle and you got your grating end. So that goes in this hand. And then the spring loaded shooter is to pull this out here on the side. So how do we load this thing? I'm gonna guess we're just pushing them in. Today, can you load more than one at a time? Okay, we're gonna try it. We're trying it. No, I'm not doing it right. Okay, hold on. Let me get the pizzas out. Oh, I don't think I was supposed to put too many in there at the same time. We've committed a critical error. It's coming. It's coming out. Maybe I can get it this way. No, there's no lip. That's the problem. I can't get it around the lip. Uh, kids, don't try this at home. I'm going to use 
a very tiny knife. There we go. All right. Okay. Now we're doing the manliest thing possible after not figuring it out without the instructions that we knew were there. We're now going to the instructions to see what we did wrong. Oh, it goes in through his back. Bingo. There's your problem. Oh, there you go. All right, so how does this feed in? So it goes in through the back. Whoops. Oh, and then they feed in. Now I get it. That makes a lot more sense than what I was doing. Okay. So he's got a fully loaded, you can kind of see in there that there's, you can see the lip of the very last one. So they're in there. I see what's happening now. I can see that it's going to zap me. Let's get it to the, let's get it to zap the camera. Oh, there it goes. Oh, their pizza shooting, folks. Very cool. Okay, I love this. This figure rules. Yeah, that worked super easy now. Okay, so let's take a look at some of these sweet details. Like I said before, it's got the bulging eyes. And then the detail here is nice, having the, the speckles or whatever. You got the giant teeth. You got the pizza chomping. You got the 90s muscles with the veins, the overly done muscles with the veins. Very cool. Very nice build, heavier than a regular turtle, obviously, because it's got the extra stuff on it and there's some sort of mechanism on the inside here. Um, I actually kind of think this pizza thing maybe should go in this hand. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah, it makes more, it has a way better fit in the other hand. So there you go. Cool, all right, so number one of three done. Uh, oh, also too, if you get these things, if you buy them as a set, if you get them in, a, they come in a case and it's cheaper too than getting them individually, you'll save like 10 bucks. So there's another tip. If anyone's interested in grabbing these, they're still widely available. Uh, I can get them or you can get them on Walmart still had them, uh, as a case as of October of 24, end of October 24 and then eBay, but Walmart uh, was the cheapest by a fair bit and they were straight from Walmart, not from, uh. A subseller. So there you go. There's a review for Pizza Toss and Mike. Very cool. Two thumbs up for Pizza Toss and Mike. Very cool. All right. And we'll see you guys again for another retro review. And we'll be taking a look at another Pizza Tosser. All right. Have a good one. Thanks. Oh, as always, please like, subscribe, share, all that stuff. Cool. Thanks, guys. Have a good one.